Hey y'all, my name is Erica Smith. I'm a physician assistant here at SPA 316. Today I'm gonna to be talking you through week three. So you've made it through the first two weeks. Um, you've done a great job. Usually about week three is when we start seeing those plateaus. So what does a plateau mean? That means that you're not really seeing the weight loss you were seeing in the first two weeks. Um, remember, we really do want you weighing every day and make sure that you're weighing about the same time every day as weighing at different times can affect the weight on that scale. Um, so for plateaus, we really need to see that you're not losing any weight for about four, five, or six days in a row. If you feel like you're just stuck, can't do anything else, we want you to remember a few things. Go back to your food journals, make sure that you haven't added any foods that you weren't supposed to, make sure you haven't any, added any extra salt, as salt will cause a little bit more water retention, will re which will result in weight gain. Um, check on your bowel movements. So, Emmy's gonna be talking to you next week about a little bit of constipation. That usually kind of starts to set in about week three or four, just due to the decreased calorie intake by mouth. Um, also, make sure that you're, you're kind of moving around. Get at least 20 minutes of light exercise in every day. So that could be walking, that could be yoga, simple stretching. Um, if you're like my husband, you can get a little intense with your housework. Um, so just try those few things to kind of help with the plateaus. If you've looked back through everything, you're following everything by the book, you're drinking your water, bowel movements are regular, try doing an apple day. So what does an apple day mean? That means at lunchtime on one day, you're gonna start by eating nothing but red apples. So you'll pick one large red apple. When you get hungry, eat it. You can continue this every time you get hungry until lunch the next day um, for an up to six apples. You have, can have nothing to, else to drink except for water. So water and apples. This will kind of help reset everything, get everything moving a little bit better, and it will kind of help ramp up that weight loss for that week. Um, other tips and tricks would be add a little bit of green tea. Sometimes green tea can kind of help boost that metabolism a little bit. Um, if you need some help in the constipation department, um, Emmy's gonna give you some tips on that, but you can always add a little bit of smooth move tea, some Miralax, um, or some milk and magnesia to kind of help get those bowels going just a little bit. Um, lay off the red meat. We usually like to tell people to limit red meat to about two times a week. You can also look at your vegetables. Uh, try not to mix those vegetables during those first couple of weeks as sometimes that will cause a stall in um, weight loss. If you've tried all these things, come talk to us. We will absolutely try to figure out another way um, to kind of get you back on the right track. Stay strong. You're almost halfway through this six-week program. I know 500 calories is tough, but you're doing a great job.